Dear students, uh, continuing with organic reaction mechanism, this is our 46th lecture and in the series of aromatic electrophilic substitution, in this lecture we will discuss about Gatterman reaction. Uh, Gatterman reaction is very important uh, reaction in case of uh, electrophilic aromatic substitution and uh, this is also known as Gatterman formylation or Gatterman uh, salicylaldehyde synthesis. So, basically uh, this reaction is an electrophilic aromatic substitution reaction where uh, formylation of the aromatic system will take place in presence of a mixture of uh, hydrogen cyanide and hydrogen chloride. Uh, using uh, Lewis acid catalyst uh, such as anhydrous aluminum chloride as the catalyst. And if you see the overall reaction, uh, this is similar to what we have seen in case of Friedel Craft reactions. So, only thing is in case of uh, Friedel Craft reaction, say in Friedel Craft alkylation, we have used uh, alkyl halides and Lewis acid as the catalyst. So, here instead of alkyl halide, we are using a mixture of uh, HCN and HCL. The mixture of these uh, uh, along with the Lewis acid, they will act as an electrophile which will be added to the aromatic system to give us an intermediate products which on hydrolysis will give us aldehydes or ketones as the product. Now, for example, if we are to uh, see the simple mechanism of this reaction, in the first step the hydrogen cyanide that is HCN reacts with HCl and anhydrous aluminum chloride and we are getting this type of intermediate where nitrogen is bound to the catalyst uh, through uh, coordination uh, uh, with the uh, lone pair of lactones present on the nitrogen and because of this this will acquire a delta positive charge uh, and uh, the creation of delta positive charge on nitrogen will uh, lead to the attraction of lactone density of this pi bond towards the nitrogen hence this carbon of this intermediate will become electrophilic carbon and because of this uh, electrophilic uh, nature of this carbon this will be attacked by the aromatic system and we will get this types of uh, this type of intermediate will be formed uh, the uh, hydrogen chloride of this uh, carbon nitrogen double bonded amine will be formed and this uh, hydrogen chloride of carbon nitrogen double bonded uh, aromatic compound will undergo hydrolysis in the presence of water ammonium chloride will be removed and this will be converted into a carbonyl compound. So, aldehydes they will be formed as the product. So, overall if we see the benzene will be converted into benzaldehyde. So, formylation of the benzene has taken place. So, that is why this is known as Gatterman formylation. So, uh, Gatterman for formylation because uh, this reaction was given by uh, the scientist named Gatterman. So, that is why this reaction is also known as Gatterman reaction, Gatterman formylation or Gatterman salicylaldehyde synthesis. Salicyl uh, salicylaldehyde synthesis will be there if instead of benzene we use phenol then the product formed will be salicylaldehyde. So, uh, this uh, reaction Gatterman reaction can be extended to phenols also. So, monophenols, diphenols, triphenols all these phenols they undergo Gatterman reaction and ortho substituted aldehyde they will be formed in such cases. Then uh, in place of HCN Al 
Cl3 combination we can as an alternative we can use uh, zinc cyanide also and this zinc cyanide will also act as an electrophile which will as a catalyst for the electrophilic aromatic substitution and uh, this serves as a catalyst which will in situ generate the electrophile and formulation of uh, same acetylene can take place uh, uh, when we use zinc cyanide and mestaldehyde will be formed as the product. Then uh, one modification of Gatterman reaction is Gatterman coach reaction. So, here only thing is uh, if we replace hydrogen cyanide with carbon monoxide then uh, the products will be same only difference is that now the catalyst formed is different. So, if we replace hydrogen cyanide with carbon monoxide then the Gatterman reaction is known as Gatterman coach reaction and uh, uh, the only difference between Gatterman coach reaction and Gatterman reaction is that as I have told you that Gatterman reaction can be used for phenols and phenol ether substates, but Gatterman coach reaction is not applicable to phenols and phenol ether derivatives. So, here uh, what happens is uh, the carbon monoxide first reacts with uh, hydrogen chloride to give us this type of chloroformaldehyde. So, then this chloroformaldehyde reacts with uh, Lewis acid that is anhydrous aluminum chloride and uh, we get this type of coordination complex where because of the attraction of electron density toward more electron active oxygen atom this carbon becomes more electrophilic and this chlorine also withdrawing in nature. So, this carbon is even more electrophilic and that is why this will be attacked by the aromatic system and this intermediate will react with the aromatic system to undergo formidation at a very faster rate. So, that is why uh, this reaction is also used in industry for formylation of benzene to benzaldehyde. So, these are the references which have been uh, used to prepare this reaction. Thank you very much.